Hello, this is Montas, and this is the third video of the centralized lending on Cardano. In this transaction, me as a borrower, I'm going to pay back the loan plus the interest to the lender. And in exchange for that, I'm going to receive a collateral from the smart contract. Okay, so let's go to our dashboard. And this is my borrower's account. And here I have a loan at depth of 10,000 mint tokens. Uh, for which I'm going to pay a fee or interest of 50 AADA tokens. Additionally, I'm going to get back 1,100 AADA tokens from the smart contract. And a very important point is that anyone holding the NFT points bond is going to see this position. So if I send this token to someone else, someone else on this UI will see the position that they can repay. Okay. And that's that NFT bond is important to make this transaction to happen. Okay, so that's a short confirmation. And when I click confirm, the off chain code is going to generate a transaction that will consume the NFT bond plus the loan and the interests and send it to the lender. And that you can see in this transaction. Let's go, let's briefly go through it. You can see two things are going out from my wallet, uh, min tokens, 10,000 min tokens, and B token. That's the NFT bond. That's the loan I have taken some time ago. I have took some time ago. Uh, additionally, I'm going to get 1,050 AADA back. Uh, that's very important because the loan what the collateral was 1,150 ADA was an interest. I'm getting only 1,050 back. 50 is going to a lender. As you could see in the details, that's the mint tokens that is going to be sent to smart contract. Also, a no tokens that's going to be sent to smart contract and lenders NFT that they have to transfer from one smart contract to a different one. All right, that's the dummy metadata. Uh, but it does not. And yep, so let's confirm the transaction. Let's check the transaction on Cardano scan briefly. Um, so that's the transaction with all the UTF cells from my wallet. Additionally, some other UTF cells. And also, I'm consuming from the one small contract. And I'm sending assets to a, a different smart contract, additionally with a lender's NFT bond. And if I would refresh this dashboard page, you will see that I don't have any open positions in, in here. And me as a lender, the person who actually lent the tokens. We'll see that the status of the loan have changed and there is no time left and I can claim an interest and the loan from the smart contract. So that's about the third transaction of thank you.